Hello everyone, Sigma Later here, and welcome back to Tomb Raider. Hopefully you enjoyed the last episode, and if you are a new subscriber, welcome. Hopefully you'll enjoy the rest of this adventure. Oh, bit of lag. Never mind. Days have passed since the plane crash. For a second time, we attempted to escape by boat with disastrous results. I knew it would happen, just like the first time. The calm sea turned hostile with no explanation. The moment we made for open water, the winds picked up, followed by an impossible wave. Like a child's toy, our lifeboat was smashed violently into the rocky shore. Now, two more lie dead, and another is wounded beyond help. The others are starting to panic, and they're looking to me for a plan. I do have one, but it doesn't include them. They are weak and stupid, a liability in this place. I suggested they make another attempt to leave, but I won't join them. To do so would be suicide. This is clear to me now. What a lovely man. We'll soon get to the bottom of this mystery. Uh, no, nothing in here to collect. Got the stuff in there. I believe there is shit down here to get. Yes, a little cave. My memory do good. And get the map. I uh, can't get you. So I can't light fire. Lara no make fire yet. Okay, I've got as many arrows as I can carry. Is that a thing I can smash? Is that one of the challenges? Yes. Nice and easy. Stealth is key. Another thing there. Got it. I'll take those tomatoes, whatever they are. down there oh yeah I forgot there was a thing there I can't shoot that one yet okay that was badly done never mind don't judge I are expert game player. Oops. Yes, give me all the nuts and bolts. The nuts and bolts that let me turn a wooden pickaxe into a metal one somehow. Uh, a thing. That's three out of five. Excellent. Nothing more around here. Yeah, just run across it, that's fine. It looks steady enough. There's another one through there. Can I hit it? Yes. For somebody who's apparently uh, inexperienced, she seems to be an expert shot with the arrow. But again, again she probably took up archery. 
when she was uh, young. How do you know? Oh, that's that challenge done, that was easy. You two, check that side. Now, I usually do always die in this bit. What the fuck? Sure, shoot at me while you were fucking moonwalking to the side. That was some serious bullshit. You two, check that side. How about you two do fucking nothing? Come on. You're not stuck on anything. Move. I told you, I always die on this bit. Come on. Let's run. Got ya. <laughs> fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Just run. <laughs> I told you, professional gamer here. Well, that was fun. Let's read a book. When we washed up on this rock, the rain and wind pounded us for days. We couldn't build shelter or forage for food. Christ, we couldn't even move. It was like some enormous hand was holding us down. Just as the storm was finally breaking, Father Matthias came to us. He was calm and soft-spoken. He seemed to know us, our names, where we were from. He spoke to us in our native language, and we listened. And as we listened, he told us the truth of this island. He offered us a choice, salvation or death. Some chose to defy him, and without hesitation, he killed them then and there. Father Matthias didn't seem malicious or angry, just calm and decisive. As I stood there in the sand, wet with the blood of my comrades, I knew I could never refuse him. Guess that's what happens when you've been pushed to the edge. You will accept any, <laughs> any form of help, even if it comes at somebody as psychotic as Matthias. Got all the GPS catches, got the done the pyromaniac thing. Haven't got any of the relics in this area. I, I seem to keep thinking that there's like a thing to pick up around this area, but I suspect I might be wrong. Oh well. We'll do a bit more exploring before we continue on.
Give me fire. With a stick that should be wet and unable to burn, but meh. Physics. Yes. Give me all salvage. That's the stuff. Oh, need to go this way. Ah, a relic. Yes. We are doing well. Sock fan. Could have been used by a villager or a noble, maybe. Uh, whoops. Oh, shit. That was risky and stupid. <laughs> yeah, let, let's not do that again. That wasn't very smart. Right, what's down here? Hey, the other relic. Samurai to relay orders to their soldiers in battle. Pretty solid. Must be made of stained cypress. Very pretty. Okay. Well, that's this area 100% done. Hey. We are making a very good progress. If I do say so myself. Uh, get rid of the flens. What are you looking at? There's nothing of any interest there. Now run in a straight line. There are people trying to kill you. This is not the time to be acting like a doofus. And there you go again. I can do this. Yeah, you can do it, Lara. I believe in you. Come on. Oh, you're letting me down, Lara. Come on. Shake that booty. Get it up there. There we go. See? Going on there. Hey, rough. I hope we get the dual pistols back in the in shadow. I do miss the dual pistols. But uh, the arrow, the bow and arrow, has been a good substitution. I have to say. Sorry, they did a real number on your leg. No, looks worse than it is. Have you heard from any of the others? Nothing. Wait, what are you doing? The wolves took my food pack. The transmitter from the lifeboat's in it. If we don't get that back, we're not getting off this bloody island. Yeah, you need you need bandages, morphine, antiseptic. They're also in the pack. Shit. Exactly. Come here. Let's put you by the fire. Oh, oh no. No, 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 Oh, don't do this to me, you northern bastard. <laughs> okay. A little insight okay. Okay. To, to any non Brits watching the North and South Divide. <laughs> Uh, it's all, all good humoured, for the most part. Thank God he's still alive. Yeah, now, now we've got to go fight some wolves. Where are those wolves at? 
observant, Lara. Well done. Should really mock. I'd, I'd be hopeless at tracking. Pack's up there somewhere. How nice of them to let me know where it is, though. Those are some very good wolves. Alright. Hey, birdie. Chicken, hello. The chicken. Ten got like ten statues. The fuck was that? I don't think I've ever heard that noise before. It was like a scream. Ah, it was the wind. Never mind. Return to your duties, people. Twas but the wind. Remember rightly, there should be a nest with an egg in it. Well, maybe not in this roof, but there is a GPS catch. Or a cache, whatever they're called. Lucky that fire didn't set. Lucky the the flame didn't set fire to all that rope. Right, maybe it's not on this roof. Possibly, just read a book and find oh, out. Night, I was at last granted an audience with Her Majesty, Himiko of Yamatai. I must confess, she is unlike any woman I have ever encountered. Beautiful, yet inscrutable, calculating even. She surrounds herself with her priestesses of the sun. No men attend her, save the general of her armies. When I met with her alone, I came to realize that she is not at all what she seems. I was sent by my lord to spy on her to assess the strength of her army. But now, I feel she is the one assessing me. My lord has perhaps underestimated the threat of Yamatai. Though I cannot gauge the true strength of her storm god, I cannot deny a powerful feeling that the Sun Queen should not be trifled with. You hear what they say? You should always go with your instincts. That was a good book. I liked it. Any the things? Anything out here? No. Alrighty. It's really weird. I found that since I've been on and off making YouTube videos, despite the games that I'm playing, I've played a million times. I know them inside out. You know, come, as soon as I start recording a video about them. I, I seem to I keep forgetting really simple basic elements of the game. It's really weird. Maybe it's because I'm trying to concentrate on trying to uh, make somewhat entertaining commentary while well, trying to remember what I'm doing in the game as well. Who knows? Uh, can I can I actually get in there yet? Can I? Or is there another way in? Ah oh, yes, there is another way in. But uh, we'll leave it for now. I don't want to go down there just yet because then I have to probably take the long way back up so we will focus on this area for now I think that is probably the smart way to do it
Give me the salvage. Scary music. Quite looking forward to the Shadow of the Tomb Raider game, even though it does come across as a bit very Indiana Jones. Lucky. Yeah, packs in there, but for now, let's do a quick bit of exploring around here. I don't think I can actually do this one yet, can I? Oh, but there's a thing. Yeah, I can't do this one yet. Alright, so we'll do the walls, and then I think this that will draw this episode to a close. Come on. Come on, baby, I like my fire. Thank you. Come on, baby, I like my fire. Yeah, I know I can't sing, but that's not going to stop me. <laughs> I think it's safe to say these walls have definitely developed developed a taste for human flesh. Right. We've got Roth's bag back, we've got the GPS thing for the endurance. Okay, I've got to get this back to Roth. Master of understatement, as always. Fucking wolves. Come on. That's it. It seems a bit weird to me that there was only one wolf in here. But at the same time, I'm not an expert on wolves. I know they hunt in packs, but I don't know if they live in packs. I'm sure, I'm sure they do, though. I could be wrong. I could be right. Who knows? In this topsy turvy world, right? You can get rid of the you can get rid of the fire now, Lara. We don't need it. Whee! I don't know if you've ever been zip lining before. It is a lot of fun. I highly recommend you try it out if you haven't. Hi Roth, I got the stuff. Right, let's fix your leg. And then I'll do my arm and shit as well. And maybe do that injury of the spike I landed on at the very beginning because that's been untreated for quite some time. There we go. All done. at the nine bells <laughs> or got nothing on a broken bottle <laughs> hey you got it nice work so I assume the plan is to take that up to the radio tower well, it should give us the best shot of broadcasting a strong signal in every direction Yeah, I was 
afraid you're going to say that. You can do it, Laura. Yeah. After all, you're a croft. I don't think I'm that kind of croft. You will be. You just don't know it yet. Yeah, you've got a better pickaxe. Instead of one that magically turns from wood to metal. Well, that's happened my fast learner then. Of course you are. You've got me on your side. Just be careful, Laura. You know me. Well, her. Cheers, Ross. Right. Thank Good. God for Ross's training. All those tracks, all those climbs. As if you've been preparing them for something like this all along. It's clear that there are people living here. And they're organized. They're killing and recruiting. Why? It's like some kind of cult. A cult of what? What do they want? Who knows, Lara? All right. One hundred percent done. Okay, cool. Right. This is like a good opportunity to end this episode here. If you liked it, guys, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and hit be sure to hit that bell icon as well to stay notified of any future uploads. And be sure to leave some comments down below. If you've got any idea, any suggestions for ways I can improve my video, my vi the quality of my videos, I'll greatly appreciate it. Thank you for taking the time to watch this, guys, and I will catch you next time. Sigma, later, out.